Welcome back to our retaining wall project in Duxbury, Massachusetts. We're here to explore step two in the six step process of building retaining walls, which is excavation. So now that we've done the planning and prep work, we're ready to start excavating. With the area marked out and elevations determined, we can dig out the trench for our wall along with the area to be backfilled. Now to determine our excavation width and depth of our base trench, we can use a few different methods. The six by six by six method is a simple one to remember. Now when using this method, we want to have the base width six inches in front and six inches to the rear of the block. This provides a stable foundation for our wall to prevent rotational settling or tipping and will also allow for compaction equipment to fit in to consolidate the base material. Now the depth of the base also follows this rule, meaning six inches of compacted stone. Now soil conditions and design criteria may require additional depth, but six inches is a basic starting point. Now the next consideration for excavation depth is the embedment of the first course of wall block. The industry standard recommends a six inch embedment at a minimum for the first course of wall block. Again, site conditions or wall height may increase the amount of embedded wall block needed, but as a rule of thumb, six inches is a standard. In this example with a six inch base, that will be 12 inches of total depth of excavation. Now once all loose organic material is removed to the proper width and depth, it should be leveled and compacted, making it easier to create a solid level surface to install your base. On the back side of the wall, you want to excavate further to allow for a minimum of 12 inches for your drain stone. Additional width will be required for walls that fall outside of the basic installation criteria to allow for increased drainage or potential reinforcement. Thanks for joining us on the job site. We hope you gain some helpful insight into excavation for retaining walls.